I have to unload a dump trailer full of hay um, from right there all the way down to the barn. So I'm going to be doing a lot of walking with hay bales. Well, if I can figure out something to hook up and uh, all of these hay bales. All those have to go down to the barn, and I gotta take them down there. What is the most boring job is filling up a big air bubble with air. It takes a long time. <laughs> we decided to just get the little trailer and use that because it'd be a lot easier. But now I have to go throw them all up into the barn loft. I get this weird feeling that I'm gonna lose a lot of those hay bales. Maybe not, I don't know. I'm not going that far. We decided just to back them into the uh, <clears throat> garage and look. Nice tight fit. <laughs> I was shooting Josh's muzzle loader yesterday, so I gotta clean it because it stinks. And muzzle loaders. If you don't clean them, are very dirty. Sam has a thing of change, and I have not seen it. I don't know if he's seen it. Um, I saw it a little while ago. You saw it a little while. Okay, so we're gonna guess how much. I said there's twenty nine or twenty dollars and thirty nine cents in there. So place your bets in the comments below as to how much is in there. And comment below, and if whoever gets it the closest, I will. Send a signed corn cob to you. No, I'm kidding. Just place your bets in the comments and we'll see. Okay, now we're gonna see okay. what it is. I'm going to bet fifty dollars. Fifty? Whoa. Mmm, whoa. I was way off. How is there fifty dollars? There's tons of coins. That, look at the bottom. Does that, does that look, look like right fifty down to you? Here. Look, Doesn't to me. I guess there everywhere. is quite a few quarters in there. <laughs> I don't know. But I'm cleaning the muzzler on the kitchen island. You can see this is down the barrel, how dirty it is in there. It's really not focused very well, but it's you can still see how dirty it is. Sam, Bree, and I are going down to Griswold. Um, we're going to go to the bank is having an open house so we're gonna go to that and uh, gotta take some change in and stuff like that Josh if so you are watching this don't don't look okay because your person got you a Christmas present and uh, I'm gonna open it and look at it it was me that got it so oh. It's a piece or a 12 inch long of AR 500. Deal. <clears throat> Let me yeah, tell it you, is heavy. it is heavy. I had to get another van to get it out of the mailbox. And it was icy and. Shoot, steel? Okay. Okay, okay. So you did you tell Dad about the ice? Huh? Do you let Dad know about the oh, ice? No, I forgot. He's, you better let him know. Look. As on what it looks like. Don't drop it on your toe. Yeah, no kidding. It's a piece of AR 500. People wear that. Wear this? Like? Yeah. Look at that. Body armor. Yep. Protect it. <laughs> now it looks. I have good. to just set it on my belt because <laughs> if I don't. Now I'm just going to package it back up, just so that way it looks like brand new. This so is I the got best for Christmas. Okay. Me for Christmas? No. Three. Oh, man. Oh, like, this is for me. This isn't exactly the best tape ever, but... Is Christmas or... Oh, she needs it. 
Emmy is wrapping Christmas presents and I'm gonna wrap my... I just ran upstairs. Okay, let and me in from the car. tell you something. Okay. Do not buy wrapping paper without the lines. Like, like, um... See? See the lines? You need lines. to buy wrapping paper. No lines. Like this, so you can actually cut okay. a straight line because look at my beautiful... Emmy. This one's okay, but... So, we're gonna wrap my Christmas present for my person, and then... Not your Christmas present. Well, not mine, but because for somebody. When you don't have enough amazing plaid wrapping paper, you just put little strips over it, and then when you fold it over, you already have it covered. Because I was too lazy to cut some off the roll. Caleb is being very cute. He's being very precise, no. and he's like untaping things so that it looks perfect. Well, when I wrap one present a year, you know, you gotta make a good one. And it's very funny. I've wrapped like three or four presents in the time he's wrapped one. <laughs> yeah, I'm not even done, so don't say that. I almost done with mine, wrapping this one. See, if you take your time, it turns out nice. Not saying Emmys didn't turn out nice. I didn't really look at them, but I guess we'll see. Guess what happened last night? I didn't video anything because I was already in my pajamas and stuff. But, look. It snowed. Not a whole lot, but it still looks cool anyway.